hello guys welcome back to my channel this is hadidi makeovers so for today we are going to be doing a nigerian a northern nigerian bridal makeup look with turban starting off i'm going to be using the cetaphil moisturizer that's after cleaning her face with the simple micellar water i'll be using the cetaphil moisturizer on her skin alone she has a very dry skin and i don't really like using primer these days because all my models are always um like they have dry skin so this moisturizer works for me very well i'm going to be using a damp beauty blender to press in the moisturizer and wait for the moisturizer to settle into the skin and then moving on i'll be using the ferrarucci concealer palette to correct her skin tone if you can look at the upper part of her lip the side of her eyes and also under her eyes she has um sunburn and then discoloration i'll be using that to cover the imperfections like the the skin the discoloration of her skin using this orangey a light orange shade in the concealer palette i'll be blending that out also using my damp beauty blender can you see i just corrected the part where there are discoloration disco uh, where there are discoloration on her skin so after that after blending in um the color corrector into her skin using my damp beauty blender i'll be going on with my foundation So before we move on to the foundation i want you to look at her skin very well can you do you notice any difference with the color corrector i don't want her to be too red that's why so i'll be going on with the khalifa foundation in the shade wafa and um biscuit i used wafa and biscuit on her skin tone to get um the shade to get her correct undertone you know when you're applying foundation when you miss the undertone then there's going to be a problem so as you can see i'm applying that all over her skin on her face rather i just go lightly i don't like applying too much foundation using the damp beauty blender as well can you see that i'm just pressing in the foundation this foundation is just very good i don't know but i think i love this foundation it works perfectly well for me and i really recommend if you guys can get it too can you see i just blended in the foundation in the shade the califa foundation in the shade wafa and biscuits so we are done with our blend can you see how flawless her skin looks it goes with her neck can you see that so i'll be using the zikel concealer in the shade um neutral for her highlights I'll be highlighting that using this tiny chinkini beauty blender um, I'll be using that under her eyes the bridge of her nose the forehead and also on her chin so So guys, I'm going to be revealing a little chinkini secret for you guys. I used my setting spray immediately after I finished blending my foundation and my concealer. So I would recommend if you guys don't watch my videos, you should watch my videos always because I always drop a tip, one or two tips like that. So that you see the secret behind how flawless my skin work always looks. So I just sprayed the found um the setting spray on her skin. I want the skin to look um very very smooth and also I want the foundation to settle in perfectly. 
like it's her natural skin tone do you understand what i'm saying so yeah that's just about it i sprayed her face waited for it to dry then i moved on to contour her nose using the ferrari concealer the dark shade and also making sure I don't have lines under my eyes before applying my setting powder. I forgot to take a picture of the setting powder I used. I used the um, super. I'm sorry. I used the Espon setting powder on under her eyes, the bridge of her nose. Shall we? I highlighted before. That's where I used the setting powder on. Then moving on, and I'll be using the cons um, the powder palettes. Um, the Khalifa powder palette to set the whole face and um, yeah that's just about it So if after I'm done setting her skin with the Khalifa powder palette, I'm going to be using my spoolie to brush up the hair, the brow hair, and using my Davis pencil in number 18 to draw outline her brows. After outlining, I'm going to be filling in her brows and using the um brow tint from Beauty Line by Didi to brush up the hair so that it looks fuller and also gives her gives us the illusion that she has fuller brow hair I'm going to be going over her brows with the brow tint from Beauty Line by Didi So, so I highlight my brows. I'm going to be using the Ferrari concealer to highlight my brows, to highlight her brows rather. Highlighting her brows is going to be like um, I'll be doing that very lightly because I, because I had to do the skin work before doing the brows. So yeah, that's just about it. I'll just do that. Let's fast forward, and um, yeah, I'll be blending with this my fluffy brush. And then voila, we have a smooth, outlined, sweet and beautiful brows. <laughs> I'll be going in with the eye primer, the Cl Benign Clown White Eye Primer. I'll be blending that out on all over her crease using the urban decay eyeshadow in nocturnal i'll be applying the very new delight shade i have there it looks like powder guys so i'm going to be applying the eyeshadow all over her crease blending that out smoothly then using my um blush palette for the transitioning i'll be contouring with the blush palette her eyes with the blush palette and also transitioning and blending everything out with that same blush palette can you see that so you know we already say she's a bride yes and the house of Lani bride they are always always all already looking pretty so i had to go over her eyes with her bronzer her shade of bronzer like um the avor bronzer in number two i used that bronzer over her eyes again and also lined after applying my eye mascara and then yeah i'll fix the lashes now boom she has her lashes on and then we move on to the lips i'll be using the shade um the classic makeup um lips 24 hours lip stain in the shade um coco bean on all over her lips then going in with the shade nude from classic also 
I'll be using the shade nude all over her lip on top of the, the inner part of the lip sorry and I'm using the gloss from classic makeup too in the shade nude I was in a hurry when I was finishing the video so I forgot to take the picture of the lipstick I used but they are all from classic makeup um yeah I applied that too on the cocoa bean this is the nude lip gloss i'm using that all over the lips again so we get this nude sweet can you see yeah so that's just about the makeup i'll be going over her face with her shade of powder from the same califa powder palette to take off our setting powder can you see that i'm just using the powder i'm not wiping off the powder I'm just going over the setting powder again with um, her shade of powder to get that flawless look. using the blush palette that same girls night out blush palette i'll be applying that all over her cheeks and um yeah can you see that it's also going to serve as a contour for me that's what i do always i don't really contour the face only if you have a white face then i'll be going in with the bronzer the avor bronzer in the shade number two i'm going to be applying that on her cheek can you see she's already glowing I'll be applying that on her cheek, the bridge of her nose, the forehead, and also under her chin. Can you see that? Yeah, that's just about it. Then we spray the face and that's it, guys. I'll also be doing the last but not the least, the finishing of the face, the last touch-up, which is going to be applying the mascara under the eyes, smudging under the eyes, and also don't forget applying the eyeliner that will be the next thing i'll be applying the eyeliner on top of this other eyeliner using a liquid liner from the mabrook eyeliner so guys that's just about it for today's video i'm going to be um uploading the next video in the next two days so guys please watch out and um, please don't forget to subscribe like and also don't forget to comment this is hadidi makeovers once again and i love you guys so much please subscribe let's get to 1k please guys and um yeah the next video will be the video on this turban this bridal turban i tied so if you want to get that just turn on your notification post your notification bell rather you can turn that on and yeah that's just about it i'll see you guys in the next three days bye guys i love you so much don't forget to subscribe bye